summer and today I have got my first ride back since Winter had kind of removed from her foot which is so exciting. I've got a lesson so I thought that I would film a video so you can see what we get up to. I've done three sessions of lunging, lunging and she did so well in them all and then on the last lunging session we did some jumping and she did amazing. She was such a good girl and she actually jumped like 95 centimetres like the pole was the pole was 90 I think but she jumped like she over jumped it a bit and like she jumped the top of the block so yeah he did so well so I can't wait for the lesson and I'm going to be wearing this today so I need to go get her tech and then we can tech you up yeah I think um, my instructor's coming in half an hour, so yeah, get you tacked up already. Yeah. also had a fresh fresh clip the other day which I did a video um, about and I think it looks quite good now we're also going to be trying this half pad and um, because her saddle like slips forward a bit or the saddle pad slips back um, so we're trying this to hopefully make sure it doesn't slip as much and we've not tried it before, so first time. Let me pull it forward. Right, I think that's good. And then I'll get her saddle. Oh, here we go. I would like to put her girl panels on. Are we doing that? And then check there. Okay. And I'll do her again. Try and sit down. Um, that way. Because we've got this girth. I don't know whether I've said this before, but it's basically got like I think it's called a half moon girth. I don't really know. But because she's got a, a forward girth groove. So the girth was like rubbing on her shoulders, rather than it being like there, it's like there. So the girth was slipping forward and then rubbing on her shoulders. And apparently that was like one of the reasons why it was slipping a bit. Um, so we've got this girth and she is so much better with it. And you can tell by her movement, like when she's trotting, she like extends her leg more rather than like holding it so we started off the lesson with a good walk round to make sure she was all warmed up and she was feeling quite fresh on this day because I mean she hadn't been ridden for six weeks so it was probably a bit exciting and she had a fresh clip so what couldn't we expect but the main goal for today was just to get her nice and forward and stop her from putting her head down and bronking, which, I mean, at the end, it was better. But I did end up falling off and I got it on video.
Wednesday, whenever we got to this corner, she has a little mini bronc and tried to stop and turn around and stuff. But at the end, we had none of that. And even after falling off, then um, at the end, she was perfect going around. And we did a few laps of that just to leave it on a good note. And this is where I fell off. If I hadn't have grabbed onto that fence, I would have probably flung straight into it. And I was kind of expecting to fall into it, but yeah. <laughs> Eventful winter, she was quite naughty, I've got to say. Yeah, you tired now? I ended up falling off, but because <laughs> I'd said before, because she'd like tried it before and she did this like little bronc in that corner over there, and um, and then I said, Imagine if I fell over the fence, and then the next time I did it, I ended up falling off, but I caught myself on the fence because I grabbed onto it. So, and it wasn't too bad. I thought I'm bent in half though, so it's, so it's a good job that I'm flexible. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe because I really do appreciate it. And I'll see you all next time. Bye. Mummy, Alice is behind winter. <laughs> I know. Bye. <laughs>